One team remaining. This is the culmination of the team acrobatic final, the United States. The only team here that can take the gold medal away from China. Mind you, at their best, their score is very close to the score that China have earned in the final. A degree of difficulty here, 21.5, but is the highest of all the teams. They've gone for high risk to really wow the audience with their Amazon's themed routine. Very quickly into the formation changes as well for the artistic score. getting behind this performance. Wow. I've been so looking forward to watching that team since I saw it in the preliminaries. Exquisite choreography. And, well, a special mention to Bill May, 44-year-old, who has really been such an ambassador for getting men into the sport over many, many years. He said after the prelims he was so excited to swim he thought he was going to explode. And I think that was my worry for them today, that maybe they would over-egg it and just go too hard, but it was fantastic. Well, they're in with a real shot at the gold medal here. Their score in the preliminary was only just on two points shy of uh, what China have scored here. The United States have won only one gold medal. They were initially the dominant team in uh, world artistic swimming, but they've won one gold medal in the last 20 years, and it was by this man, Bill May, and uh, of course his partner, Christina Jones, in the duet technical at uh, Kazan eight years ago. So what a story this would be if they can get the gold. It's he is certainly aiming for, aiming for Olympic qualification so that he can make history. 
after all of his hard work to get men included. Special mention to Andrew Fuentes, Anna Bodicina and Lara Taxida, the coaches. 232.4, it's a silver medal, silver to the United States, and the gold goes to China. <laughs> the enthusiasm, the delight on their faces, they don't hold back at all, do they? And that was so well deserved, a silver medal at a World Championships. Wow, incredible. What a finish to this competition. China holding on for the gold medal. The United States just conceding a couple of crucial points from their preliminary swim. 232.4, so in the end, the margin just uh, around five and a half points. And the bronze medal goes the way of Japan. But they are delighted. Their fans in the crowd, equally so. I, I talk about teams and pulling together and all being, having that same dream and that same goal. And the United States of America depict that probably more than any other team that I know. They all work so hard together for the good of the team. It isn't about individuals. <laughs> and the reaction from the United States, surely they were hoping for, they knew they were so close to a gold medal. But, oh no, but, they were hoping to be on the podium. Well, they are delighted with silver. Absolutely, and that's the point I'm making. They are thrilled to bits with a silver medal. There's the result of the team acrobatic final. China the gold, the United States silver, and Japan the bronze medal.